If I ask you that can you edit and view the leads which are converted and your answer is no, then probably you are wrong. You can do that. Now let's see how. Editing the converted leads is not a new thing in Salesforce. It was already available in Spring 16 release, but now it is revamped in another way in Spring 17 release. You, being an administrator, need to first identify that which user needs this permission. Only administrator or uh, different different users of different different profiles or permission sets. So let's first see that how we used to assign this permission to any of the user, including administrator also, in Spring 16. In Spring 16, there were two permissions which you need, which we need to set on a particular profile in order to uh, like make available editing the. Uh, converted leads for that user. Uh, for example, there is a user A. We need to give both of these permissions to that user A if we want that user A to edit the converted leads. And these permissions are set audit fields upon record creation and the second one is update record inactive owner. Both of these permissions need to be enabled on that profile or like these permissions should be assigned using a permission set and given to that user who needs to edit the converted leads. This is uh, like how we used to do in Spring 16. Now let's see how in, uh, like how we do it in Spring 17. In Spring 17, there is a complete different permission for it. And that permission is view and edit converted leads. You can uh, like give this permission to any of the profile or uh, like to any of the user with the help of permission sets or profiles. And that user will be able to edit and view converted leads. So this is the basic difference. Like the odds which are running on Spring 16, uh, like over there, I mean, converting a uh, editing a converted lead is available using these permissions. But if it is working in Spring 17, these permissions will not work. You need to give this permission on the profile or on the permission set in order to give the user access to or uh, like give the user permission to edit and view the converted leads. This is how we do it. You must be wondering that why do we need the permission to edit the converted leads because they are converted and now there are into accounts contact and opportunities like all the information of that lead is now into account contact and opportunity. And if we have the permission to edit the lead and uh, like view the lead then we can like convert it again and there will be duplicate accounts and contacts over there. So why do we need this permission? Your consideration for this is truly valid but there comes a business scenario or a situation in which the sales manager or the marketing manager or the administrator of that particular organization needs this permission and wants to change the edit uh, and like wants to edit the lead records just for reporting purposes. In that situation it is helpful. This is how our lead record looked like when uh, it was already converted and we were trying to see it. But after giving this permission, this is how it looks. Look at the status field also. Over there. And here are the lightning versions of it. This basically means that editing records from Salesforce Classic, Salesforce Lightning and Salesforce One all is applicable. If you are trying to locate these two permissions in your profile or in permission sets then let me tell you, you need to first enable these permissions from somewhere and that somewhere is set up then go to user interface and there is a permission enable A means set audit fields upon record creation and B update record inactive owner user permissions. You first need to enable this over here and then you'll find it in profiles and permissions. Congratulations, you have successfully learned that how you're gonna edit the converted leads and now you must be trying to give this permission to yourself being a system administrator. So let's imagine this is you and you are on the system administrator profile and you are trying to assign view and uh, edit converted leads permission to this profile. You are you have, you have click uh, like you have clicked on this permission or like this profile system administrator profile and there is this permission available over there but this but it's not editable. Then how you'll do it? So, on standard profiles, whatever standard profiles are there, it's not available. You have to uh, like like use a, another workaround to give uh, like edit and uh, view and edit converted leads permission to a particular user. On standard profiles, like the users who are assigned to a standard profile cannot have this permission. This permission can only be available on custom profiles. Or if you still want to give this permission to a user who is on a standard profile like you, 
So you need to like do a workaround and that workaround is assign this permission to this permission set and assign this permission set to yourself. That what that means is that assign this permission set to all the users who want this permission. That's it. This is the workaround you're going to use now. But unfortunately, you still can't unconvert a converted lead. But don't be sad because I'm here to help you out. So hit the subscribe button down over here. And if you're watching this videos on Facebook or even on the LinkedIn, there's a link down in the description. Hit that link, go to the YouTube channel, hit the subscribe button to get weekly videos all related to sales for so. See you next week. Until then, bye bye. Take care.